All right, this one's gonna be on uh, Team Mux 3.0's right-click menu. Um, not sure why they made it or who's it for, but we're gonna check it out. All right. So uh, first thing you wanna do is you actually enable um, mouse mode, whatever your hotkey is. You gotta enable it. All right. And now you can actually use your uh, mouse here and then right-click, and you have this menu here. Right. Now if you let go of the right-click and you move around, it'll disappear. But if you right-click and actually hold down the right-click. Uh, you can actually highlight over these things here, right? And then you can do, um, you know, a split, another split. And if I list something out here, I can actually swap this here, swap up, swap up again, swap down, you know, get the idea here. Um, they have zoom and unzoom. So if I want to zoom this one here, you know, unzoom, stuff like that. So, um, what else can you do with this one besides, you know, the hotkeys that you can do in the keyboard already? So, they do have this thing where uh, you can copy stuff. Um, let me give you an example here. So, by default, if there's nothing on the screen, uh, you get this menu only, right? That's the default. Um, but if you have some stuff like paths and stuff like that, or maybe a line that you want to copy, you can do that. So if I right click on um, this, you see now you have like a, you, I can copy this whole line right there uh, where my mouse was at. I can copy just the uh, path. So I copy the path here. Um, you know, it's in my clipboard or my Tmux clipboard. And if I want to like just copy and then type it out or aka paste, they have this thing called type. So if we can actually do uh, type here and then there you go. It'll, um, Type that out in here in your um, you know, your read line here, right? Uh, so that's what you can do. Uh, anything else in here? I mean, you can actually uh, search. Although let's just give an example of search in here, right? And it'll, it'll enter copy mode. Um, so that's what they have, you know, for copying and pasting and and uh, searching. Um, not really that useful in my opinion. Uh, now, when I first heard of this feature, I thought you can do like uh, your own custom commands where you can actually, um, you know how you um, right click on this and you have a enable copy line or whatever it is. And then uh, from there, you can actually do like open a web browser or stuff like that. Like, you know, in the GUI, give you an example here. You know how you have a web browser and you can, Right, you know, highlight a text or whatever it is, and then you do like search, right? Um, and it'll search for you know whatever your default uh, web browser is. I wish you can do that with this also. Um, so it'll you know you can actually like um, assign your own custom commands with it. Like maybe right click and um, do a zip or something. You know, you right click on this file and I want to zip this file. Or this folder, whatever it is, right? Or right click and uh, search for something in my uh, command line web browser or something like that. Because I know you can do that in the keyboard in copy mode. Because I showed you that last time. So I'm giving you an example here. If uh, I'm in copy mode, I can actually, uh, uh, for example, this Zen map here or whatever, right? I can actually uh, run this, um, you know, whatever I highlighted here in my copy mode. I can actually open that with my uh, W3M web browser and I'll search Google for that word, right? So if I wish they can do something like that um, with the right click menu, otherwise right now it's, it's pretty useless. Um, you know, besides like the, the copying, uh, I think this one's kind of useful. You, you copy that line of, um, you know, the path or whatever it is and you can actually paste it, whatever. But other than that, it's kind of useless. Like all these other hotkeys, I really don't know anyone would want to use the hotkeys from this menu and when you can just do it with your keyboard, right? And pretty much it. Now the right click menu here, you can actually still use your uh, uh, keyboard hotkeys to go up and down with your arrow keys or you can actually use Vim hotkeys with J and K to do the split and stuff like that and when you hit enter it will do, you know, whatever it is that you have it there not really that important so as far as the the, the right click menu is kind of useless but maybe though they're improving the future i mean you can actually uh 
Let's go with the man page right here. And we will search for display menu. Right, and they do have some options in here that you can edit, although I'm, I don't think I'm gonna try to edit any of this because right now I don't see any usefulness out of it. Again, if they actually add those features that, uh, you know, you can actually customize and um, run the commands that you want to run um, when you're highlighting it or copying it, uh, that'll be a different issue. Because right now, if I try to do the right click thing, because that's when I first heard of this, that's what I really wanted to do is just like highlight something, right click. Although you can't even right click because you're still in stuck in copy mode, right? So I have to hit and use my hotkey exit copy mode and you know I still then you really can't search anything else um, so it's kind of useless but maybe they'll actually make it useful in the future because right now I really don't know who is it for um, maybe they'll make it in a desktop environment that would be great right I mean I'm using Tmux as my desktop environment anyways uh, for the most part anywho let me know in the comments what you would use this for because uh, I'm not going to use it <laughs> at the moment the way it is. All right. Who knows? In the future, they might impress me and we'll do some customization. Otherwise, right now, it's really not that important. That'll be for this one.